Hello guys, welcome back to my channel once again here on YouTube. Today I'm going to show you my custom uh, WCW latest pickups that were put together by a kind friend of mine who've done my other WCW um, customs and those WWE ones I had a few of as well, like uh, Crown Jewel 2018 for example, I can't remember the other one or other ones, but yeah, the custom ones basically. Anyway, I'll quickly show you then, guys. So we have Starcade 83. I guess this is NWA stroke WCW because this was before. It was mainly WCW, wasn't it? So it was NWA or Jim Crockett Promotions or whatever. Uh, Starcade 83, a flair for the gold. And each of the discs all look like this they have the wcw logo on it says dvd video there on the right hand side and then it has the name of the the event the pay-per-view at the bottom there on each one exactly the same all of them there's the spine sorry guys i can't remember if i showed you that now which looks really cool harley race there in the picture at the top and there's the match listing on the back from November 24th, 1983. Quite a while ago, yeah. <laughs> Nearly 40 years, but yeah, still some interesting sounding matches there. Dog collar match, Greg Valentine versus Roddy Piper, for example, stands out. Uh, Abdullah the Butcher versus Carlos Colon. And obviously the NWA World Heavyweight Steel Cage match, Harley Race versus Ric Flair. That's other matches, yes. Yeah, Starcade 83, the first ever Starcade. Next up, Starcade 84, Flair Roads. Flair and Roads on the spine there. The matches, I don't know if you can just about make them out. We've got that color clash problem again with the camera with red and black. Good job I don't, I'm not doing a video of the NWO Wolf Pack, isn't it? <laughs> um, yeah, we have Tully Blanchard versus Ricky Steamboat. Uh, Manny Fernandez versus Black Bart. Uh, Rick Flair versus Dusty Rhodes. Special guest referee Joe Frazier. Just to name a few matches there, guys. I don't want to go over them all today. Just quickly showing you. And as I said, they're all the same, Those disc, the disc artwork pretty basic and really cool good description got the name on the bottom as i said next up starcade 85 flare and roads again i do believe yeah sorry i was just looking for the the matches on the back there yeah flare and roads again and from now on, I won't show you the disc, guys, because like I said, they're all the same, pretty much, apart from the name. Different on the bottom. Bash at the Beach. I might need to show you the disc of this one, because I'm not sure what year this one is. And there we go, 86, and this is a two-disc set, because it was uh, an event that was spread over two separate evenings, apparently. So my friend was saying... Uh, Starcade 86, the Skywalkers, that infamous uh, scaffold match. Um, Jim Cornette obviously doesn't like looking back on this match very much, and I can understand why, bless him. We have Starcade 87, Shy Town Heat, Chi Town Heat. Shy, I'll say Shy Town. I don't know how to pronounce it. I'll say Shy Town. It looks like Shy Town. I'll go with that. WrestleMania. Nah, I'm only kidding. Starcade 87. But Starcades are like the WrestleManias of WCW or NWA, aren't they? I personally think. Then we have Bunkhouse Stampede 88. Bunkhouse Stampede Finals. Oh, cool. It's like a tournament then. Maybe. The 
Price for Freedom, the best of the Great American Bash. Cool. Quite a good little set. Starcade 88, True Grit, with Lex Luger, uh, Press Slamming, Ric Flair there, I think that is. With Sting and one of the Road Warriors maybe on the back. Or is that the Barbarian? Well, no, it is the, one of the Road Warriors. It says Dusty Rhodes and Sting versus the Road Warriors. Yeah, so apologies for that, guys. We have Shy Town Rumble, Chi Town Rumble, Shy Town Rumble. How the fuck do I pronounce that? <laughs> I need to look that up, I think. I'm going to go with uh, Shy Town. Seems pretty cool as well. Sting versus Butch Reed. Rick Steiner versus Mike Rotunda. The Midnight Express with Jim Cornette versus the original Midnight Express with Paulie Dangerously. Loser must leave NWA. Sounds badass. We got Wrestle War. 89 Music City Showdown. Sting on the front there. Ricky Steamboat, Lex Luger, the Road Warriors. Cool. 1989 Great American Bash. Terry Funk and Ric Flair and Lex Luger there. The glory days. Great muta there. The top picture. Something scary now. We got Halloween Havoc 1989. Ooh. The Road Warriors on the front. Just about to see the logo there on the spine. Settling the score. It's scary. It's frightening. It's blood curdling. The Sting, Flair, and Terry Funk there on the pictures. Nice. Very cool. And then finally, Starcade 89 Future Shock. Who will survive to become the wrestler of the 90s? Ric Flair, Sting, the Great Muta, or Lex Luger? The same as the VHS UK release. That uh, DVD cover looks pretty cool though. Always did like that one. But yeah, that's my uh, WCW or NWA, if you will, uh, DVD collection from the 80s. I think that's every pay per view. I'm not sure if I'm missing any. So that's all of them covered now. I'll start probably covering, um, collecting for the rest of the, the ones from the 90s I'm missing and get them all on DVD. Um, because the tapes are just ridiculous to come by and I like to watch them all through properly for reviews and you know just for personal reasons just out of enjoyment of reliving WCW and I can't do that if I've got all these gaps with tapes that are hardly ever for sale or if they are for sale they go for like I don't know say for example 50 quid sometimes more and then on top of that you also got a risk giving over the money and then get it sent a uh, original copy or a stupid you know dodgy pirate copy that's what you know like a bootleg one that's what puts me off but yeah that's the reason i've started to collect all these together now for my own personal uh collection but yeah let me know if you like these in the comments below guys give me a thumbs up if i deserve one today um, thank you for joining me for this you all stay safe and take good care of yourselves and I'll see you all again soon peace